Good morning. It is Saturday, August 12th. Uh, and Beth and I, we had we had plans. Mm -hmm. We got stuff from the grocery store. We were gonna, you know, I was gonna know, cook. Yeah, she was gonna cook. We were gonna make breakfast here. It's affordable. It's it's the wise decision. Bacon and cinnamon rolls. Yeah, it was gonna be yummy. It still sounds good. But but that requires power. It does. Require and at like 4:30 in the morning, mm -hmm. I wake up because the fans turn off, mm -hmm. and the room just starts getting hot, and the the white noise goes away. Mm -hmm. And I look over and the clock is off and I was like, oh, the power went out. Mm -hmm. It's now nine, four and a half later, hours later, and um, per the power company is still assigned to a service crew, whatever. <laughs> they still haven't fixed the power. Yeah, it took them until like a half hour ago to figure out that the reason the power went away during the thunderstorm overnight was weather related. They still don't have an estimated time for it to be back. I just think that their 430 crew is just not the top tier crew. I think their 430 crew said, eh, they don't need power and rolled over and kept sleeping. Yeah, like that's kind of where I'm at. I was like, I was like, who really needs power at 430? Adam. Me. It's the fans. He's precious. He can't sleep in the hot. Mm -mm. So he didn't give up his blanket. He just kept sleeping with the blanket on. I took off my blanket and then suddenly my toes were cold, so... Ah, uh, no, I did give up my blanket. Oh. I moved the blanket and I slept on top of the blanket. Mm. Every time I looked at you, it looked like you were covered up, so. Nope. But. No. So now we have to figure out somewhere to go that has power where we can get food, because it's, it's nine at this point and we're hungry. Mm -hmm. And actually, we got upstairs and Doug was was cooking. He'd, Mad. he'd manually lit the gas burners on the stove mm -hmm. uh so he's making bacon mm -hmm. and beth figured out well we can't do cinnamon rolls because those need those need oven could do french toast so we st we, we were able to, to save money and just have breakfast at home anyways breakfast at home uh otherwise drove out and it looks like there is someone at the condo working someone um i don't want to bother them i'm glad they're in there that that's like good <laughs> um so we're gonna we're gonna head out and do something Get out, get moving, get the blood flowing. Yay. Power came on like right after we finished eating. Of course it did. Yeah. You don't sound happy. You're like, get get going, get the blood flowing. I'm like, lazy. Stop it's like it. almost 11. It's making me be productive, you guys. It's sad. We're not really productive on anything. We're just productive. moving. Doing things. Yeah. When I just want to curl up. We, we curled up extra late. You, 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 you were in bed like for like almost 10 hours. That's what you do on weekends. What are you? You crazy morning person. <laughs> crazy morning person? Yeah. Yeah. It's ridiculous. Eh, you love it. I love you. There's a difference. There's a difference. No difference. So Beth decided we could go to Ikea because like maybe what three weeks ago, four weeks ago, something like that. It's been a while. We, we came here and we got through like half of the upstairs mm -hmm. and it was just like, eh, that was enough. And so we're going to keep looking through. Um, so that'll be fun. And really it's just trying to keep my mind off the fact that they're working on the condo and I'm anxious to get back in there, but I still have to wait. <sighs> so we're going to do this. She was all like, how are we going to pick up? We don't even remember where we were. I'm like, oh, I remember what shortcut door we just, we exited through. I know where we were. And finishing looking around upstairs, it was mostly at like dressers and wardrobes and things because Beth will need something at some point. At so, some point, we so not, Yeah, we had time, but I got downstairs and we've been, I've been finding stuff. That we need. We need well, some that I need and some that's just fun kitchen stuff. Some of it we want, some of it we need. Yeah, like I got the curtain wires to be able to do the division in that's a need yep and then we got like a milk milk frother that's a want yeah <laughs> so we've, we've got some stuff and we walked around and spent some time and looked at stuff and it was fun but now someone's thirsty i thirsty so she's all like she wants to she wants to go get some tea and i was like i like tea she but wants to get fancy tea boba tea he does not have to get the boba i, I don't know what a boba is tapioca 
I don't know if I like that. That's okay. You can try mine. Okay. We're gonna go get some bubble tea. So we's we's got we's got teas and it has stuff in it. Boba. And then and then I'm supposed to stab. I'm told. Yeah. Do it. Do it quick. Ready? You stab things. Mm. It's weird. <laughs> I can't just swallow them. Mm -hmm. Chewing them weird. Swallowing them fine. No one for chewing So which them. was this one? Strawberry. Strawberry. Mine's coffee. I've not gotten any of the pudding. Hold on. Mine could be sweeter. It's strong coffee. Mm. I like the strawberry milk tea. I did not care for the boba part of it. Yeah. Is is weird feeling. Well, maybe ch did I tried hers that had pudding, did not like. Yeah. Uh, maybe there are popping pearls that have like flavored. Maybe that would be okay. Like that's what I expected. But it would be was like a popping thing. It's, it's not. not. No, I knew it was. It's like a gelatin. It's chewy. Yeah. But the popping ones are fun and good. So another time we'll try some of us. But we've tried it. Mm -hmm. And you didn't hate it. Yeah. No. I mean, I like tea. I know. No vehicle out. Nothing in breezeway. Still a box on the door. Still a box on the door. <sighs> so what time are they going to be here today? Because it's at this point kind of late. So we went back to Beth, and mm -hmm. I cried for a bit because I'm upset about not, you know, not having work done on the condo. Yeah, it's dumb. And um, not and, and told not. mom, and then, and then, and so she's gonna contact them and try and figure out what's going on. And meanwhile, Beth said, "Let's go get food, and we're gonna go get Dewey's." Dewey's. And we decided to split a pizza. Uh, she got pepperoni and bacon. I got the meatball, and. Uh, save a little money so we're gonna eat and then because I am somehow still trusting that when they said that they will do the condo today that they will we're gonna eat and then maybe head over there and, and see if anything has happened we might get her some ice cream first I don't I don't know why I came over and thought maybe maybe they just would have started late it's like seven now but obviously nothing is done. There is still no floor. I'm starting to feel foolish for like trusting them when they give me a promise of, we'll do it on this date. Oh, we missed this, that date. We'll do it on this date. And they keep doing it. I, I, have, I have no way to like, there is no punishment for them. They keep failing to to do this, and the, and they just get to be like, okay, maybe this time. But I am continuing to be upset by still not being able to move into my home. Um, we're gonna go back to Beth's, I guess, because that's still where I must live then. Um. Maybe watch Doctor Who or something and call it a night. I'm supposed that, you know, their third promise, you know, sorry, you know, the first one was unrealistic. Sorry, we promised unrealistic. The second one, oh, something happened. We'll pay overtime and get people there on the weekend. Will you now? They just keep lying to me and it's upsetting. Anyways. Hopefully, we get to have the adventures of Adam moving back into the condo soon if they ever decide that they're going to do the job that they're being paid to do. Thank you for joining us. Join us as our journey continues. Bye. Bye.